Here's a follow-up video with my 1981 Briggs Conserver. As you can see, it's pieced together to replicate what it would look like installed. And I got my Bemis round open front seat on it, which looks pretty cool. This tank has a kind of like a retro look to it. And it kind of looks a little older than it does. This looks like the handle that would probably be stock on this type of tank that Briggs offered at the time. Because I've seen these come with this handle stock as an alternate. Um, it has the uh, 1989 Fluid Master 400A. Oops, sweet for the camera for the focus there. And uh, this flush valve, come to think of it, when I pulled it to replace the gasket on it, is made by Hooverline. We've got some installation parts. Um, and it's got a quirky flapper. I'm thinking of trying it out like this, and if I don't like how it works, uh, putting the Mansfield 210 flush valve and coordinating handle in it, along with my older early 80s Fluid Master 400A. But this is the water line, this bump here is for the water saver, and here's your stand, your regular water line right here. So it was made on July 8th, 1981, yep. So yep, there's a quick overview of this toilet. And uh, I am definitely, here's a plan, here's a quick plan with it. I am definitely going to install it in place of my Mansfield over there just to see how it flushes and of course the Mansfield is not going anywhere I'm going to keep it if I don't like the way it flushes I'll put the Mansfield back for the time being and if I like the way it flushes I'll keep it and probably when I move out I'll leave this one behind but yep that's the plans for it and uh, we'll see y'all in the next video